Good morning. Thank God it's Friday. So I'm gonna complain about something really quick and I wanna make one thing really clear first. So my school is having a blood drive today and I totally believe that blood drives are an amazing thing and if you can donate your blood, do it because people need blood. But I'm one of those people who cannot, I have a fear of needles and like the feeling of blood being drawn is just completely just terrible to me. And the what I want to complain about right now is the placement of the blood drive. They put it right outside the PAC and this is by one of the entrances to our school and it's like taking up like a lot of the area and it like it's just really hard to walk through there for me and see people getting their blood drawn and like be near that because it just walking past it makes me queasy like I can't f stomach it really so I wish they had it like I think they did it in a, uh, the gym or like the forum last year or something. Um, so I really wish they had done it in an enclosed space where people didn't have to see that if they didn't want to. Or if people didn't want to be watched while they're giving their blood, they didn't have to be watched. That's just, I just wanted to vent a little bit about that. I'm gonna go to the grocery store and get food. I got like an hour before I have to come back to school, so. Oh my gosh, like, now I'm all shaky and queasy just about thinking about it and stuff. Like, seriously, people, trigger warning. Trigger warning, please put that in a room where people don't have to see it. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot to tell you guys, I got an interview at STOM. I have it next Thursday at 3 o'clock. I'm really excited. Hopefully it all works out and goes really well. I'm gonna head to play now. Um, when, when I'm done with play, I think my mom and I are gonna carve our pumpkin before going to the concert because we don't really care to see the opening bands right now. Um, so that's gonna happen. And then concert. Get ready for a video packed night. So we're carving my corpse bride pumpkin. Um, I have stuff on my fingers because there's like the strings are all sticking out through the holes kind of so that's what she's doing right now she's trying to get all that out but that's what it looks like right now i free-handed that i was like looking it up a picture of it on the internet and like drawing it on there with a gold sharpie when your daughter is the most awesome artist that she can freehand the design on the pumpkin before she carves it <laughs> My mom is super proud of me all the time. Sometimes it's kind of annoying, <laughs> but it's it's great. Pumpkin guts feel so weird. Like just having your hands coated in all that goop. It's like ugh. <laughs> we'll see how this turns out, though.
done. I feel like the only way we'll be able to tell if it looks good is once we put the candle in it. But that's it. I did it. It's the corpse bride. I'm cleaning it up right now. It's my first time carving a pumpkin and doing it all by myself. Fun times! <laughs> <laughs> She looks so good if you can see her on the camera. I did it. Some. I did it! It looks like the corpse bride! It does! It's a little wonky, a little fatter than usual, but it looks good. Yay! Fun times! We're heading off to Mayday Parade now. Let's not hit any trick-or-treaters on our way, okay? That was pointed to you. Love you, Mom. So it may not look like any time has passed, but it has. We just got back from the concert. It was really fun. My voice is a little hoarse. But now that I've been talking instead of screaming, it's coming a little bit back. Well, it's gonna get dark here. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, that's better. Hi, I found you. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. So, that's it for Friday night. I will see you guys tomorrow in the same vlog. Um, if you haven't noticed, the concert is not in this vlog. I'm gonna put it in a different video so that there's less footage for the big weekend vlog that I'm putting up on Monday. So yeah, good night and I'll see you in the morning. So happy Halloween. I just got to the playhouse. I was running a little late, but I'm here. Um, I kind of have a really bad headache. I think I might be a little dehydrated so I need to find water somewhere. I was gonna go to Juice Co. I don't know. Where can I get water though? I'm gonna have to get some during intermission. But I need it now. I could go down to the gas station. Tough decision. I'm being kind of festive today. With my spider web shirt. There's like nowhere to park. Not in that parking lot which is completely full, not on the streets anywhere, so I had to park up there, which we're technically not supposed to do, but I had no other choice. <laughs> so I went to Juice Cup, because I decided I don't have to buy water, I can just refill the cup in the green room and everything will work out. Cool. So the shows were pretty good today. Um, so now that I'm home, I'm just going to relax for the rest of the night, probably play some Sims. Um, I'm going to watch a couple movies. I'm going to finish Mostly Ghostly because I didn't get to do that before I went to the playhouse. And then I'm going to watch Corpse Bride and we'll see whatever else I can find on Netflix just because Halloween and stuff. Um, <laughs> so that's the plan for right now. If there's anything worth filming, I will film it. Uh, but no guarantees right now. Um, yeah, and then one more day to go before the weekend is up. And on Monday, I have my first school matinee for Juni B. Jones, which hopefully will end around like 2.30ish. And then I'm gonna head to school, edit this video, and then have play practice from 4 to 10 because last week of the play at school. Come see the Crucible. It's Friday, Saturday, Sunday of next weekend. Um, tickets are like $7 for students, $8 for adults, something like that. Um, even though it's not my most favorite play in the world, the acting is really good and the set's really cool. And you can check out the poppets we made, because that's really the only thing we made right now. Um, it's at the Valley Performing Arts Center, Staplin Performing Arts Center. 
So yeah, come see it. I'm watching you. So it's a really nice day out and I haven't eaten lunch and I forgot my water at home. So I decided to walk to the gas station, which is just down the street from the playhouse. It's like really nice out, but these cars are really loud. Okay. Um, anyways, it's Sunday now, uh, if you couldn't tell. Um, two more shows today. Hopefully they go pretty well. It's going to be another chill night for me though. I'll probably just play some more Sims. I just got the University Life expansion pack. I'm kind of on a Sims binge right now, if you can't tell. Um, but yeah, good day. Let's go. So the street that I'm walking down right now is a one way, but everybody always goes like the wrong way out of the front parking lot of the playhouse. It's really annoying. So even though you really think you only need to look one way, you need to look both ways because people are stupid. So about halfway through the first act of the, I don't remember if it was the first or second show, I realized that since the matinees, are tomorrow and Tuesday. I won't be at school for most of the day. Um, I don't really have any classes in the afternoon that I can go to once the matinees are done. So it, it's kind of pointless to just go there. Um, but I need to edit the videos. <laughs> so I'm going to go in after the matinee tomorrow to edit the this video actually um but then the video for tuesday tomorrow's the video i'm filming tomorrow um i have a haircut at three o'clock i think um so i can't actually go to school so i was thinking i would edit in the morning before i leave um, try to export and upload it while I'm at the playhouse before I have to go to my haircut or else it's just not going to get up that day because I don't have access to school computers during the play rehearsal that night because I finish my haircut, I come, I go to school and we ate dinner and then we go into our rehearsal, which is like, I mean, I can bring my computer and work on it during, but I'd rather get it up earlier. So I'll just work on it in the morning and I don't have a good computer. I'll figure something out. But anyways, that's it for today and this weekend. Um... So I'm going to go ahead and sign off right now. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe, especially if you want to see more videos. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Um, and then check out all my social medias. I put them down in the description below along with my web store and my Flickr where you can see all my photographies. And then... That's it. I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.